Hey everyone, welcome back to Vlogmas Day 16. I'm so excited you guys are back. And in today's video, guys, I'm going to be sharing a clean with me, but it's gonna be a little different because I will not be cleaning my own house. I will be cleaning someone else's house, which I'm so excited to share with you all. So my friend gave me permission to clean her house and film it, which I was so thankful for because I get to show you guys this content and you get to see a different perspective of someone else's home and how their lifestyle is like um and let's just say i was really excited to do this so the person that i'm going to be cleaning their house for is one of my friends she is a working mom with three kiddos and a baby on the way and i am just so happy to be able to do this for her and i really hope that i was able to bring a smile to her face or able to you know just give her a break because you know being a mom and also being you know a worker is so hard and sometimes we need to give ourselves a break so i was really excited to do this i'm not going to be talking much throughout this video just because i am rushing to upload this for you guys but i want you to know that i am so happy that you are here and i hope that you continue watching So before I start wiping down these bookshelves, I am going to try to give them a really good dust just because that's super important before wiping them down. I'm going to dust them off and then I will wipe them down individually with my Mrs. Myers Peppermint um, Antibacterial Spray. And then after that, I will go in with a wipe just to give it an extra good clean. And I was really happy with how they came out.
Also, I do want to know, I tried to put everything back the way that I remembered how it came and I may not actually do it correctly, but I tried to put everything back that belonged on the bookshelves just out of respect for them and hopefully I didn't mess up anything at all.
I don't know about you guys, but I really love to see how everything gets taken off the table and then it gets wiped down and it just looks so different after and I love the before and afters of shots and it's like my favorite thing to watch over. Watching this right now makes me super happy. Seriously though, mopping has been one of my favorite things throughout this video just because it was super satisfying to see all the dirt come up and I really loved how it turned out and I was just really happy with it all.
I just have to say how smart is it to have a little breakfast area that is so smart when I have kids I think I'm gonna do the same it looks so cute and I love this whole setup and just to clean it off and dust it off really good made me really excited to see the outcome of it all and honestly I loved this transformation 100%
halfway through this vacuum my vacuum actually died which kind of was unfortunate but I just went ahead and used the broom which always works I kind of feel like I always have to um, sweep after vacuuming just because I feel like there's always things that always come off the floor especially in the corners where it's hard to reach
A new home for a while, let me feel alive. Nothing to hold me back, take my time, just enjoy the ride. I know man passing by, life is good, best I've ever felt.
about to leave already packing come with me i'm not really asking we'll get away to a place where we don't know about to see the world in action what we can be life with no distractions we'll get away this is what we Okay guys, so this is the end of the video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed. Today I really focused on the entryway, the living room, and the kitchen. And I really hope that I was able to bring her some joy when doing this. And also I hope that I was able to relieve some stress that cleaning can cause. Especially because it is super stressful to clean after yourself. Nonetheless, I'm pretty sure it's worse when you have kids. But I really hope that you guys like this video and stay tuned for tomorrow's video and I will see you next time.